Find in love when you least expect it. It felt like it was by accident, but was by purpose. God's purpose. When two people actually acknowledge each other, love at first sight, it was a bond within a bond of communicating with each other. Understand that, wait, my past don't live here today. This could be real. Could this be true? Is it true? I'm feeling you. I ask for all the qualities in this one particular person and you show up today and it's truly you with no malicious intentions. I'm truly in tune with you. I'm willing to meet you halfway. Not to fake gaslight you. Something that you're not used to. That's what your past bought you. It's nothing but trauma and pain, but that doesn't live here today. Because when the love of your life comes into your life, when you least expect it, they're not trying to show you what your past bought you when it came to trauma and pain. They're here to uplift you, motivate you, respect you. Good day, bad day, misunderstanding day. Hey, an equal exchange when we chose each other in the most healthiest way. I'm not here to dim your light. I'm here to show you the light within you. To show you that the God, light that's in you, the gift from God, days when you couldn't see for yourself, you can find balance in yourself now. When God sends the right one into your life to show you healthy balance, to show you what a healthy communication skills look like up close in person. Something that you're not used to. Someone pushing you off. Someone disrespecting you. Someone ain't got time for you. Nah, that don't live here today. Because when the love of your life come into your life, they gonna honor and value your time in the most healthiest way when your past don't live here today. That's an equal exchange for equal exchange to understand I choose my future, not my past today. When the love of your life comes into your life when you least expect it. Love at first sight. Is it real? Is it true? It's true to you. A love language that you two only understand. Your communication. They can't get in tune with how y'all vibing together. They can't get in tune with, wow, God definitely did create you two to be together for all the right reasons with no malicious intentions. Y'all value each other's time in the most healthiest way. Y'all not going against each other. Y'all uplifting each other. Show balance within a, a relationship. Wow. Balance within a healthy relationship. Something stable. Allowing yourself to become emotionally available. Days when you couldn't see for yourself. But your past don't live here today. When the love of your life comes to your life when you least expect it. They acknowledging you every single day with no malicious intentions. It's like what your thought process, you're feeding your pockets, your eyesight, because you never could buy true love. And I say that respectfully. No dollar in this world will be able to value up to actually acknowledging the love of your life. Meaning what you're saying, saying what you mean, that you were with yourself to meet somebody halfway. An equal exchange when y'all meet each other halfway to choose each other. That energy hit different. Love is real. Love is one of a kind with the right one. That's truly for you with no malicious intentions. I sleep with your time for the genuine ones only. Have a safe day. Have a safe week. Protect your energy because not everybody's having your time. Just because someone gave up on you, don't give up on yourself. Just because someone overlooked you, don't give up on yourself. You are genuinely loved by all the right people. You are genuinely respected by all the right people. And you never be treated respect and it's about days with no malicious intentions, being harmful to yourself or others around you. Protect your energy because not everybody's deserving your time and your day. You matter, you're worthy. Never allow a hate in disguise or personal malicious intentions. It's like you got your thought process, you're fitting your pockets or your eyesight because they don't have good intentions. You know, a healthy relationship is two people be on the same page when it comes to communication and respecting each other. And I say that respectfully. Love is real. Love is one of a kind with the right one that's truly for you. Two people who actually are on the same page, not going against each other. Two people who uplift each other. Two people who respect each other the most healthiest way. To understand peace in the most healthiest way. To come into union with each other and to value each other's time in the most healthiest way to honor each other. True love is not having a hand problem. True love is not disrespecting someone, allowing them to feel unworthy of themselves or allowing someone to feel discouraged or, or allowing them to feel like they have to give up. That's not love. Bring up pain and malicious intentions towards somebody, that's not love. And I say that respectfully. Or having third party conversations with somebody when you say you're a one person person, mean what you say and say what you mean. Stop playing people close and you don't have good intentions. Because you have malicious intentions when you're trying to play somebody close because you're not used to someone loving you and respecting you.
because you're not used to someone loving and respecting at the end of the day. Just leave innocent people alone when you're mentally ready and stable to be in a healthy relationship and, and choose that one person that's willing to choose you to value your time in the most healthiest way, not to dim your light, because you wouldn't want nobody to dim your light, and I say that respectfully. You know, it's not about competition when being in a relationship with each other. That's toxic. That's unhealthy. And I say that respectfully. Someone's willing to meet you halfway without wearing a mask. When you come across a real one, they don't have time for the mind games. And I say that respectfully. They mean what they say and they say what they mean. Respect and loyalty is a package deal. When it comes to valuing someone's time and meeting them halfway when someone's willing to choose them. And I say that respectfully. Switching up on you when you come when it comes to a real one, they don't have time for those mind games. Not even a little bit. It was an even exchange when they acknowledged you that day to value your time. Not to switch up on you, but to honor you and respect you. Good day, bad day, misunderstanding day. I'm just trying to be your peace in the most healthiest way when the world's against you. And when the world's not against you, I'm just trying to hear, I'm just here to uplift you and show you peace and what a healthy relationship looks like up close in person when your past don't live here today. The energy had different. Be mindful when you push certain individuals away, taking someone's kindness for weakness, because once they walk away, God had a better plan for them. And I say that respectfully, something that you can't get in tune with. And I say that respectfully. With God's potential for every direction, leave innocent people alone if you're not ready for a healthy relationship. Stop fake gaslighting people and act like you're so in tune with them. Or stop fake gaslighting people like you're so ready for a relationship, you're ready to be in a relationship with somebody, and you're not. Leave innocent people alone because there are genuine people that are out here that are looking for a healthy companionship. That are looking for someone to love them in the most healthiest way with no malicious intentions. Because there are two people that are out here that are willing to meet each other halfway without the mind games. Because love is real. Love is one of a kind with the right one. God created us to love. Healthy love. Not that toxic love. Healthy love. And I say that respectfully. Don't dim your light because someone didn't see your worth. Don't hurt yourself with your own words because someone didn't see your worth. Someone didn't know how to value your time. But you matter you're worthy for the right one to choose you every single day. I truly appreciate your time to the genuine ones only. Now you genuine love respect. Just because someone gave up on you, don't give up on yourself. Just because someone overlooked you, don't give up on yourself. You are genuinely loved by all the right people. You are genuinely respected by all the right people. And you deserve to be treated with respect. 365 days with no malicious intentions bring harm towards yourself or others around you. Protect your energy because not everybody is deserving your time of your day. You matter, you're worthy. Never allow hate in disguise or personal malicious intentions. It's like you watch your thought process, your feeling, your pockets, or your eyesight because they don't have good intentions. I truly appreciate the time to the genuine ones only. Have a safe day. Have a safe remaining month. Have a safe remaining year. Protect your energy because not everybody is deserving your time of your day. You matter. You're worthy. Stop the violence. Domestic violence is unhealthy. Bring a harm towards someone you say you love and then manipulating them and playing narcissist mind games at the end of the day is so unhealthy. That is not godly. And I say that respectfully. To the, if you have not been paying attention, Judgment Day has been here. I truly appreciate the time to the genuine ones only. Know your value, know your worth. Because you're not used to somebody loving you at the end of the day, find you and love you to know when someone comes to your life to value your time with no malicious intentions, how to value their time to respect them. Because of your trauma and your pain, it's going to hold you back from actually finding love that you're asking for when it's right in front of you when you least expect it. When a real one walks into your life with an even exchange, not to hurt you or dim your light because you matter, you're worthy of an equal exchange when it comes to healthy love. Now you genuine love, respect. Have a good day.